The hour and day of week chart can be a little bit confusing the first time you look at it. What you're really looking for here is just high level trends. Um, probably looking at one color at a time. So first of all, if I focus on the orange colors, I can see that Saturday and Sunday are much darker orange, suggesting that that's where most of the spend happens across these accounts. Obviously, when you uh, fire this up, make sure that the uh, time zones match what you're expecting to see, but you can see here that most of my spend happens on a Sunday just after lunch. Saturday's also a big day, and as you'd expect, very little spend early in the morning. Now, focusing across to green, where are my dark green areas? I'm going to ignore dark green areas across the top here because that's very, very low spend and therefore very little I can do to influence anything there. But it does seem that on average uh, into the evening tends to be a bit of a better uh, time for ROAS, although all day Saturday seems pretty good. Sunday evening seems pretty good. Tuesday evening seems pretty good here. And you'll notice there's a, there's a number in front of the day. That just helps you sort by day because by default, Google wants to sort these in alpha order. Now, if I were to maybe dig into this and say, well, how do my trends compare then if I move to mobile? I think with so many um, different accounts here, this isn't going to be particularly useful, but we can have a try. So let's look at just shopping just on mobile. Yeah, same trend applies here. Sunday is the big day, followed by Saturday. I suspect that's going to be exactly the same if we look at desktop only for this particular group of accounts. Oh, maybe not. So now we're sort of seeing that desktop spend is probably higher, uh, as you'd imagine, during office hours and then dropping off into the evening. So maybe we can take away from that, which you probably already realised, is that most people are sitting down at their desks and, and doing a search trying not to get caught by the boss during business hours. Now that everybody's worked from home, things have changed a bit. But people also are going to be more likely to be on their mobile devices, maybe tablets, in the evening sitting in front of the telly. So how would that affect your bidding strategy? Again, if you're not using smart bidding and you actually have some control over bid adjustments. If you're on smart bidding, then you can pretty much ignore this account because Google won't care what your bid adjustments are.